All right, welcome back to Rivals. Sticks and stones may break your bones, but we have some names that, that if they were yours, they it might hurt, hurt you. you. <laughs> they will hurt you. Okay, so, so, so our whole thing here. So is, here's a couple of football players yeah. solving the political <laughs> issues of the day. And this is where it, this is oh. where it warps to in a locker room. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> right? I, I, yeah. Okay. So welcome to uh, Rivals Locker Room. Uh, whatever we say in here cannot be held against us because it's in the locker room. We found some absolutely humorous names, and I have friends with these names, yeah. and, and we're going to share some of them with you, and, and you decide if you think, I don't know, you just figure this out. Uh, so, so there's one. This isn't someone I know, but I, as looking some of this up, and actually, if you want some cheap entertainment, just go Google and search for um, unusual, funny, crazy names. You'll, you'll, yeah. you, you will yeah. find, or as Jason did, just go and uh, ask your daughter. Yeah. Um, so yeah. the I first, text my children, yeah. my four children, and they just started firing names to me like that. So the, so the yeah. first, the first one is, uh, WABC in New York, the weather woman, her name is Amy Freeze. <laughs> so she went into the right the, she went into the right business the right business yeah 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 um you know my, my family <laughs> names were my mom was so creative she's kind of real artsy and poetry and all that and, and yeah jason's very artsy you know what i was the one okay candy colette kitty michelle bunny bianca lily lafon Bo brugel those are names in my family, so, right? So I end up with Jason. So thank you, Mom, for naming me Jason. <laughs> I know. So, I'm going to start calling you Bunny. So Bunny Buck. So Bunny Buck the oh, Bambi. Oh, yeah. Bunny, Bunny the Bambi. Yeah, Bugs Bunny. We call, her name's Bugs Bunny. We call her Bugs for her whole life. And can't, my oldest sister, Candy, we're, we're bucking hay for this local farming family called the, the Corns. Their last name was Corn. <laughs> Corn. And, and she liked this one boy, and we're like, Candy, you marry, you know, John Corn over there, and you're going to be Candy Corn. <laughs> candy Corn. So okay. that's the more, that's some of the more, inter, you know, innocent stuff, just in our own family, you know, having fun with it. And boy, she still gets mad to this day about that one. So I'm not laughing but, at, I'm kind of laughing at that, but it makes me think of some of the friends that I have. So I have a, um, a really good old ball, uh, <laughs> old golf buddy, uh, who has since passed away, and his name was Richard Farmer, <laughs> and we called him Dick. Yeah, that was his name, right? Yeah, was, and then you know, my I, other friend had a friend who he grew up with, and his name was Richard Long, and he called him Dick. Yeah. So I'd rather be the farmer. Uh, well, yeah. But, but you <laughs> go, you're like mom and dad. But could you, you imagine think having the name to, first? to live through? Um, that would uh, that would be that would be a hard name. To yeah. have to live up to. You're like, think through it a little bit. You're like, like you know, this this man that my kids sent to me was Benjamin Benjamin Dover, but if you're gonna call Benjamin Ben, it's Ben Dover, right? You're like, you're like looking at all these names and going, wait, we we, we can't be so sensitive anymore, uh, you know, with in our in our culture today. I mean, okay, honestly, so, let's, so, let's have a little sense of humor. Okay, with so it. I w I want you, if you can. To share a few of the names that oh. your daughter sent, the the ones we can actually that we can put on, because you can see what it's like when we get a little irreverent at the Buck House, and my kids are having way too much fun with this. When I ask them for the uh, for names, of actual literal names out there. Seymour like, Butts. Yeah, yeah. Go ahead. And how about the how about uh, um, Steve Sharts? <laughs> You know, it reminds me of a story sharted. when I was a kid. Yeah, I did more really. than shart. Uh, yeah. I actually, <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> it was it was the most embarrassing moment in my life. We're not going to talk about it today. Oh, but <laughs> okay, here's one: David Douglas, offensive lineman, Cincinnati Bengals, white white uniforms. He's sick going into the game. Big old offensive lineman, kickoff return, goes out and hits. Hits and comes around the field and looks at us all. He's like, I sharted. And you look at his pants and it is brown all the way down his pants. And we're in front of 65,000 people on national TV and, and everybody standing around him in a circle with towels and stuff hiding him while he's changing his pants so, in the middle of a game. So, wait, you played he, for the Cincinnati it out of Bengals, right? Bengals, yeah. not the Cleveland Browns? No, not, <laughs> no. <laughs> yeah. But so, so this, yeah. It's a spinoff of that shark, David Douglas, okay. for the Tennessee Volunteer, by the way. Do I dare ask for any more? Oh, man, I've got a, how about, well, Harold seems like a really distinguished name, right? But his last name is Bolich. Okay. <laughs> I mean, 
well, what do you do with it? Right? <laughs> you just don't. You, know, <laughs> you just it's, it's, you go and you're like Chad Johnson, and you just change it to a Spanish number, well, right? Well, you, yeah, Ocho Cinco. You, yeah, you change Chad, it. Just change the whole thing. My, hey, <laughs> we're going for numbers. My 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 wife's family comes from England, <laughs> and their name is H O A R. It's you know they moved to the United States, and their name's H O A R. It's whore. And they figured out right away <laughs> they needed to change that to O R R or so that you know most of the ors in the United States now they really originated as a H O A R you know coming from England. It's just really funny. You see, you, you got to deal with that. Maybe a name change sometimes. Okay, it folks. <laughs> but. We hope that you maybe have found a, a lighter side to names. And sticks and stones really can break our bones, but. Names are never going to hurt us. This is yeah. this is all. We got to laugh at ourselves a little a little bit. Anyways, you've been listening to Rivals. Rivals has arrived, and now it's time to go. But you can find us on 103.5 The Arrow app, iTunes, Google Play. See you later.